Hello again. Hope you're all well, even in your confinement. Sometimes we may be very righteous in condemning the faults and feelings of other people. St. John in his gospel tells the story of Jesus who addressed such a problem. Quote, Then the scribes and the Pharisees brought a woman to Jesus who had been caught in the very act of adultery, and they made her stand in the middle. And they said to him, Teacher, this woman has been caught in the very act of adultery. Now in the law of Moses, she should be condemned to death. What do you have to say about it? They said this to test him so that they could have something and some charge to bring against him. We know if Jesus said, yes, condemn her, they would accuse him of lack of mercy. On the other hand, if he said no, they would have accused him of not keeping the law. So in their eyes, Jesus was in a dilemma. And so the story continues. So Jesus bent down and began to write on the ground with his finger. He straightened up and he said to them, let the one who has no sin be the first to cast a stone at her. And in response, they all went away one by one, beginning with the eldest or the elders. So Jesus was left alone with the woman standing before him and he said to her, woman, where are they? Has no one officially condemned you? And she said, no one, sir. Then Jesus said to her, neither do I condemn you. Go, but from now on, do not sin anymore. May God bless you and keep you, and I'll see you tomorrow.